everyone, it's me, Darlene. I finally dug my two camera mounts out of my luggage, which I still haven't unpacked. But at least I got the mounts out, so I consider that a productive day, don't you? I am going to Walmart. I was on the fence as to whether or not I was going to go out. I got dressed, just in case. And now I have decided to go. I actually just ordered, I believe, seven items through Walmart. So that's seven items that I don't have to pick up right now. But I have to go to return the other mounts that I had purchased when I bought these camera mounts. Because I wasn't sure which ones would work for me. But uh, these are much smaller. And these were in Tova or something like that. So I'm returning those. And I will do a review on my camera mounts because they're like super cool and you don't have to be in a car to use them. You can stick them on a window if you're, you know, in a weird location and you don't quite have a place for a tripod or your refrigerated door, whatevers. I hope they stay on. My windshield was quite wet. So I'm going to take you for the ride with me to Walmart. We're going to be taking the back road, which is School Street, onto Jagger Mill Road, onto 109, onto Walmart. It's only about, I don't know, with the traffic and stuff, probably takes me about 10 minutes to get there. I believe it's like three miles, something like that. And I will take you in the store. So what more can you ask for? You're going for a ride and you're going shopping with me. So let's just get going. Yeah, I know. It's just that kind of mood. I'm in that kind of mood all the time lately. I accidentally turned the camera off. It stays on. See how quickly we forget I have to turn the other one on. I do have to put defrost because my windshield is all dark and dirty. Let's go. It's 4.45 p.m. It'll be dark by the time I get out of the store. going to bother to talk to you right now because I am taking you in the store and then we'll see if we have anything to talk about when we get out. You guys, I'm incredibly sad. 
They don't have my glue that I always buy here. Only like 47 cents or 57 cents a bottle. And they don't even have a place for it. Oh, what's that place? I need my glasses. They do have a place for it right here. It was 44 cents. It says washable glue. That's not the glue, that's paint. How come they don't have any? I wanted like 10 bottles because I'm making all the beads. Quite upsetting. I can use my Mod Podge and water that down, but that's more expensive. Let's go look at Mod Podge anyway. I'm on the hunt for this one. This is the Super Gloss, but I probably still have about, I don't know, that much left on the bottom. So I guess I could wait a little while. I have this size at home right now. Just used a little bit of it, so I don't need any of that. But uh, I've never tried the matte. I'm a glossy kind of girl. Satin, so many choices. No cheap white glue. I like 44 cents. There are so many things I would love to try on my beads. Like look at this beautiful little fine powder glitter. Oh my God, and it looks hollow. You can't tell in the camera, but you see rainbows? I do. And then the thing is I can put that on beads and then cover it with gloss so it doesn't get messy for whoever ends up with the beads. This is only $2.94. Should I get it? Look at this stuff. It is like big chunky glitter. Oh my God. If I got locked in the store, I'd have to sleep in this aisle. I'd be so excited. All right, what else do we need? Oh, I need my static spray. Toothpaste, cornflakes, ground beef. That's about it. I walked all around and I'm back here at the glitter. Thing is, is I do have some glitter. Yeah, I have some paint like this that's called Extreme Glitter. I probably should experiment with that first, don't you think? Gee, if you ever want like flat stones for crafts, go in the Fish Aquarium Center. These are beautiful. And there's some littler ones. They're only $1.97. Bet you if you buy this in the craft section, you'll pay a lot more. Look at the pretty little pebbles. I like stuff like this. Tiny little stones. So cute. Aqua jewels. Ow! The stapler! Ow, ow, ow! Oh my god. How do I put this down? I got this staple. Oh my god. Which way do I go? Ouch! Ugh. The staple was right in my finger. Did I do good? Did I do a good job getting out of that disaster? <laughs> and they're so cute. <gasps> that was weird. Not kissing him. <laughs> Got my static guard. They used to have store brand of this, but I haven't seen it in a long time. So I'm getting static guard. I do usually get liquid fabric softener too, and I fill a bottle and mix it with water and just doesn't quite do it enough for me. It'll remove static, but I need pure static remover. Hairspray doesn't do it for me either. Let's boogie. I was so hot with that sweatshirt on. Why do they even make sweatshirts? They're useless. My mother wants a box of cornflakes. I am grabbing a loaf of bread for my mother because, I don't know, when's the last time I bought her one? day ago. I know I say this all the time, but she really does eat like six to eight slices of bread a day. And uh, she's 93. Can't they just have a cheap brand of sensitive toothpaste? I always get it at Dollar Tree, but the last time I went, they didn't have any. I thought like Aquafresh made a sensitive version. Multi, pure breath, whitening, laxative. I made that one up. That would be funny. Baking soda. Colgate sensitive, $3.96. Almost the same size tube that I get at Dollar Tree. You know, I could totally make, it's not a poncho because it's open in the front, but, and it's sweater. I don't, I don't like sweater fabric, but I could totally make some of these in different fabrics. 
you know, it's a very just square cut in the front. Sleeves are open. I just think it would be cool, especially in the summer. Some nice sheer ones. Ankle length for over a bathing suit. Huh? Huh? What can we do that could be fun? I don't know. I have to think of something because I'm done shopping. I'm not ready to leave yet. Okay, so look at this. I can do that. I was at the line to get out of here and I forgot my ground beef. Five pounder. Should last me five days. Oh, and it's 236 a pound, so this baby cost me 1182. It's dark now. It is 5:37 p.m. Eastern. The sky is pink over there. It's pretties. And the moon is just a tiny little sliver showing, like just a tiny little piece of a fingernail. I feel weird. I have this weird anxiety thing going on in my head. What I'm going to call like the zapping, like when I got off Xanax. Oh, did I suffer getting off that stuff? It's like zzz, zzz, zzz. I have been off my antidepressant for what, like two weeks now? So I shouldn't be feeling any effects from that, but that's what I'm getting. I don't know. I don't care. Other than that, I feel good. Mood's good. My knee is good. It's all good. <sighs> what can we go do? Nothing. I've got to go home and upload this. Watch Apprentice with my mother. Try to get caught up with counting on. I know, I've been watching the Duggars since they first appeared on television. I know that whole family, I feel like. I like to watch them. They are like night and day compared to what my life and my family was like. <laughs> Maybe that's why I like them. And yes, they have issues too. I guess I'm just gonna say bye-byes because I can't think of anything else. Thank you for coming in the store with me. We're going to end with that. I'm going to go home, get all this stuff uploaded, and just have a good night. And I hope you have a good night also. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.